Yay! I probably have to watch an ad. <laughs> Let's see. It's always delayed, so I always have this really funny time where it's like, is this working? Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Let's see, one more time. Oh, the ad is playing. Oh, I'm gonna make some revenue on my ad. <laughs> on my own video. <laughs> All right, guys, hello, 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 hello. Thank you again so much to Twix and Leanne and Parker for super chatting already. Thank you so much, that means so much. So good to see you guys. It is a beautiful day today. No uh, lawn people. Hello, Sonia, Esther, Terry, Michelle. Woo, oh, thank you, Leanne. I'm like, I'm always wondering, I'm like, please someone say they can hear and see me. Oh, okay, this is so wonderful. Uh, oh, you can't see me. Okay, hold on. Alright guys, so today is a full body workout. Dumbbells, body weights, glory, all that jazz. Remember, if anything ever happens to our stream, I always have a backup video for us to do. And yeah, so I'm going to be working out barefoot again because I have a plush carpet. It's very, very nice. You guys are always welcome to do the same if you have the same option. Every exercise will be 45 seconds on with 15 seconds rest. During those 15 seconds, I'll tell you exactly what the next movement is. So let's get warmed up and ready to go. All right, so let's start it out. Just bounce it out nice and easy. I'm wearing bright colors. This is something I never thought I would do in my life. Like, my closet was always just black. <laughs> black, black, black. And now I'm like, I feel like being an Easter egg. Three, two, one, and butt kickers. Kick that booty in back. Drive the knees up slightly in front. Keep it going. Woo. Oh, it's gonna be a good one. I'm really excited, guys. <laughs> Remember to challenge yourself with weights, too. So if you have that heavier weight option, totally go for it. Three, two, one, and high knees. Bring your arms out into a T. Why? Because it's fun, right? This is fun. <laughs> if this is too much, remember you can always do marches and you can always drop your arms down. Three, two, one, and feet out wide. We're gonna sit down side to side with some side lunges. So really think about pushing your butt back. And then one leg stays straight. Keep going. Chest up and back is flat. So getting those lateral movements in. Oh yeah. <laughs> Keep it going. Let's go two more. Last one. And go ahead, walk it forward, plank position. From here, press into the down dog, bring it back into plank. Keep cycling through all the different angles. Make sure hands are right under the shoulders in between. Keep it going. Either way. And let's go ahead, add a knee in. So keep pressing back into down dog and drive the knee through. Warming up the shoulders, warming up the core. Keep going. So two more, last one, and let's go ahead, flip it around time. We're gonna roll, reach through. So remember to avoid your neck and your head. Roll and reach through. Ah, my tag is sticking out on my shorts. This is so awkward. You guys keep going awkward. <laughs> that gets an awkward turtle. <laughs> this is like, we're awkward turtles rolling on our shelves. <laughs> Three, two, one more, and one. All right, nice job. Let's have our fingertips facing out. Chuck your chin, your chest. We're gonna press up and bring it down. So we're stretching out shoulders and biceps and chest. Now remember, if you can't go up all the way, don't force it. Everybody is different. Everybody. Everybody, we're all different. Let's go two more. Last one, and calm down, bicycle crunches. Got to get that core nice and warm for every single movement that we're doing today. Keep going, point those toes, make it pretty. <laughs> oh, we're so pretty. Go for a few more. Oh, I feel it, this is nice. Really try to tap that opposite side knee. Four, three, two, 
One and roll it up. Turn it around. The man, let's come up slowly. Okay. All right, bounce it out again. Let's go with those jumping jacks. So tap it out. Really jump it out wide. Tap those hands at the top. Let's keep going, guys. Whew, we're almost done warming up. Three, two, one. Alternating back lunges. Getting that stability. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Keep it up, guys. Sink it down. Nice and strong. Remember, flat back, chest up. Think elevator, not escalator. So you want to sink straight down rather than shooting forward or bringing it back. Making it risky for the knees. None of that business. Let's go two more. Last one. Oh, shaky, shaky. We got one more. What is it going to be? I don't know. <laughs> Scares. So again, stability. If you need to walk it out and tap it instead, you can totally do that. Remember, it's just the warm up. It's taking a little bit easier, but we still want to get that heart rate up so it's not as much of a shock to our system when we get into the actual workout. <laughs> Which is going to be fun. Let's go four more. Four, three, two, one. Shake it, shake it. And we're going to get started. So I'm going to check one more time, make sure everything's okay in the comments. Probably can't even see me right now. All right, it looks like everything's cool. All right, guys. So, remember, 45 seconds on, 15 seconds rest. Ooh. All right, so starting out, we got three side to side jumps into a burpee. Starting out strong. One, two, three. Come down, come up, and jump. If you need to step it instead and walk it out, you can do that. All right, let's go. One, two, three. All the way down, all the way back up. One, two, three. Keep it up, guys. Remember, you don't have to go chest to floor, but if you can, it's pretty fun. <laughs> I like it. I really like it. Two, three. Stay strong, guys. One, two, three. We're just dancing. At this point, this is just a dance. <laughs> Let's jump all the way up. One, two, three. Fish it out. Last one. One, two, and done. All right, so next up, toes are facing it out. Keep your chest up. We're gonna go four punches. One, two, three, four. Heel tap. If you can't do the heel tap jumping, just tap one heel to the other. Let's go. One, two, three, four. So we're sinking down. Keep your back flat. Stick your butt back like you want to sit in a chair. Keep up, guys. Getting inner and outer thighs, which you might still feel from our workout yesterday. Not sorry. 10 out of 10. Not sorry. Two, three, four. Keep up, guys. Then we're gonna grab our weight on top. Two, three, four. Ten seconds. Four. Oh, we strong. Almost there. Three, two. All right. So grab one weight. We have one row, then a single leg row. If you can't do the single leg row, you're gonna stick with just these rows. So you're in a row. Stabilize. Row. Bring it back down. Now, you're going. You're doing it now. Squeeze that back. Go heavy if you can. I personally can't find where my heavier weights are at home right now. I think they might be in the garage from when I used to film in there. <laughs> but that's all right. Sit down, throw it back towards the hip, getting those lats. You're gonna feel it in the stabilizing leg. Make sure on that stabilizing side that you're pressing midfoot to heel. Remember which leg that you're on and which arm you have with the dumbbell. Three, two, ooh, whichever leg you just stabilized on. So sorry that I'm not. 
So you're gonna bring that leg forward and you're gonna come into a sinking lunge with a curl. Sinking lunge with a curl. Again, thinking midfoot to heel. Woo! Oh my goodness. <laughs> Stabilize, cat. Stabilize yourself. Get it together. So my glute is on fire. It is a uh, there's definitely a lot of fire burning sensation going on. That sounds so wrong. Whoever just tuned in is like, well, I'm gonna tune out. <laughs> squeeze that bicep. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Stabilize. I like to have my arm out to help me to stabilize a bit. After this, we're gonna go to the other side. Whew. All right, so other side, we're gonna go for that row, do a single leg row. All right, one side might be more challenging, so make sure you take your time. Lean forward, but have your back flat. Get ready. All right, so row, stabilize. Oh my goodness. And row, I think I found my reset. <laughs> and row. Remember, every day is different, and we don't have to beat ourselves up about that. All we gotta do, listen to our bodies, adjust, and take our time. Go back towards the hip, form above all else. We don't wanna add the row when we're wobbling. None of that. The point's not to injure ourselves. 10 seconds, guys. Woo! Sit down, row five, four, three, two, Oh goodness, guess what's next? You already know, I don't even have to tell you. <laughs> I already got that sinking lunge with that bicep curl. Good. They were gonna go back to cardio. Why not? Why the heck not? I don't know. <laughs> now it might take you a rep or two to adjust where you put your leg so you make sure that you're getting your lunge down. Make sure your elbow is behind you. If it's not in front like this, pull your shoulder blade back and down. You should be all set then. Woo. Multitasking, baby. Getting multiple muscles at once. Woo. That's nice. We like to do that, right? It's like having a bunch of internet tabs open at the same time. I know I'm not the only one. <laughs> you got three, two, one. All right, go ahead and put that weight down safely from that nice flat back. So we're gonna go with four switch feet and a tuck. So one, two, three, four, tuck. If you can't do that tuck, just a nice little hop or raise it on the tippy toes. That's cool. All right, one, three, four, land soft. You hardly wanna hear yourself. I know as we get more tired, it's hard. It's hard to control the weight, but try your hardest. Three, four, and hop. One, two, four. Keep it up, guys. 20 seconds. And hop. Two, three, four. Woo. I always feel like, like a robot when I do the switch feet. Like, it is time to kick butt. Beep. <laughs> All right, next up, tripod kickouts. At the end, we're going to have like a sprint with it. So go as fast as you can. Hands under the shoulders, knees under the hips, pop the knees up. You're going to kick your right leg out, lift your left hand, kick out, and switch. Now, try to, in between, have your knees as close to the ground as you can. Engage your shoulders the whole time. If this is too much, what I want you to do instead is come to a plank. All right, so with the last 10 seconds, we're gonna go as fast as we can, keeping form. So if you can't keep form, just keep this pace. Nice job, guys. All right, sprint it out. Go, hop, hop. It's a nice little transition. Hop, three, two, one. Woo, shoulders and abs especially, I love it. All right, so 
right, next up, we're gonna act like there's a bar here. Side duck, this leg, the outside leg, hop up. Side under, hop it up. Not to be confused with side duck, the Pokemon, the other Pokemon. <laughs> Evolves into gold duck. <laughs> Here it out, guys. All the way up. Really working. Single leg work here. If this is too much, come up to the tippy toe. You can take the jump out. But most of you here don't need to, right? Oh. <laughs> Listen to your body. Keep it going, guys. We're gonna grab our weights after this. We got four, three, two. Okay. Go heavy. If you have heavy weight, go heavy. Flat back, feet close together, hinge the hips, bend the knees slightly, alternating wide rows. So squeeze that back. All right, let's go. Remember to squeeze your core too. We don't want our lower back to jump into this. All the way back. Keep going, guys. Strong. We got 30 seconds. Elbow back behind you. Think strong thoughts. <laughs> My strong thoughts is thinking of a brownie. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Keep going. 10 seconds. I think I have brownies on my mind because one of my clients, super awesome girl, she gave me a candle that smells like brownie. <laughs> All right, so next up, down dog push up, two pull backs. So we're getting the chest, shoulders, and we're getting the back. Start it out, push up position, press back into down dog. We got down dog push up, come back, pull back, pull back. Okay, so hands are wider than the plank. You're bringing the crown of the head down to the ground. Try to keep your hips as straight as you can when you do those pull backs. Really think about squeezing that back. Press all the way back in the plank. Keep the core strong. Nice job, guys. Oh, we strong. If this is too much, I want you to press back, come up, and just lift a little bit if you can. That's cool too. Press. Hello, shoulders. Hello, cat. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Three, two, one. Okay, next up, going back to weights, we're gonna be serving biceps. Sometimes I can't talk. <laughs> Roll the shoulder blades back and down, curl, stop at 90, press out, bring it down. So full curl first. All right, so curl, stop at 90, press it, and down. It's like you have a present for me, you're like, cat, look what I got you. Wait, I really like it, I'm actually going to keep it for myself. And I'm like, well, I mean, I've been there. <laughs> I get it. If you need to do one at a time, that's okay. If you need to, you can always stick with regular curls. Getting those biceps, increasing time under tension. Nice job, guys. Whew. 10 seconds. Oh, we strong. Is it hot where you guys are? It's pretty hot here now. Three, two. Okay, next up is narrow to wide shoulder presses. I actually recommend not using too heavy of a weight just because it's more time under tension. Palms facing towards each other. Press up, turn out, press up. Okay, so keep your core strong so you're not hyperextending the spine. Right, let's go. Press, turn out, and press. Keep your core strong, guys. And we're strong. We got this. It's nothing, right? If you need to do one at a time, you can. Try to keep your wrists straight. Okay, it's really easy to bend them back, but we want nice control. 15 seconds. Whew. Oh my goodness. The last 10. Urgh. Five, four, three, two. All right, we're gonna need one weight. I'm gonna stabilize.
stabilize on my right leg, have the dumbbell in my left hand, sink down for a single leg squat, come up, and try to touch the opposite side toe, okay? If this is too much, you can always do a back lunge and kick up. All right, let's go. Nice flat back. Try not to curl the toes. Now without shoes, if you're not wearing shoes, you can really see if you're trying to just rip to dear life into that carpet. Keep it going. Try to look at maybe like a non-moving object in front of you. So maybe Leanne and Parker, maybe not look at each other while you're doing this one. Or you could be wobbly. <laughs> 10 seconds. Woo. Five, four, three, two. Did you guys just look at each other because of that? <laughs> All right, so before we go to the other side, we're gonna do some high knee punches. So why not make high knees more challenging? <laughs> That's it, all right? If you need to stick with high knee or high knee marches, do it. Now after a while, it's really easy to not bring your knees up as high. Because you get tired or you just think about the punches. So really try to think about still driving those knees up high and punching. I like to punch my opposite side hand, but it's too much thinking. Don't worry about it. Keep going. You're over halfway, guys. You're doing so good. You're doing so good. We got five, four, three, two, one. Okay, we have the other side. I'm just gonna do this. So I can see what we have next. I have it all typed out, all fancy. I'm so fancy using like a Word document. <laughs> all right, let's do it. So sink down, bring it up, and tap it. Whew. Keep going, guys. Oh my goodness, there you go. Take your time in this movement. Again, try not to grip the ground with your toes. You guys are doing great. We're doing so good. After this, you're gonna to wanna to make sure you have room for yourself. If you don't, I do have mud. Ah, uh, so that way you can do it too. Yay! Five, four, three, two, and done. All right, next up, we're gonna go in a square or box formation. So you jump forward, jump the feet out, touch down. Jump to the right, touch down. If you don't have room, jump into place, touch down. Jump into place, you get it. And then you have to do a back jump. That's the fun part. <laughs> you wanna be able to move in all planes of movement. Keep it up, guys. Tap. Keep your chest up. If you can't keep your back flat without, um, or if you can't touch the ground without rounding your back, then don't worry about touching the ground. Just sink down as low as you can. Keep it up, guys. Oh, I love this move. <laughs> Five, four, three, two. Okay, grab your weights. Squat thrusters. So not quite a squat. <laughs> well, we'll go in a squat this time. So sink down, explode up. So it's a nice explosive movement. Sink down, come into a squat. I changed it. I called it squat thrusters. We're gonna keep it squat thrusters. So make sure you don't stop at the top and then press, okay? You want a nice, Explosive movement. Keep your core strong. Keep it up, guys. 20 seconds. I need water. <laughs> Sometimes it just hits you. <laughs> I need some water. That's 10. Whew. We got five, four, three, two. All right, so I'm gonna grab this. Elbows 
elbows in, chaturanga. So, slow down, lift, lift, press. Modification, come to the knees, press, press. Just take out the lifts. All right, let's go. Another option, lift at the top, lift at the top. Triceps. <laughs> I heard you love triceps. So I got you these triceps. <laughs> Squeeze your core. Squeeze your glutes. Press it up. Come down as one unit. Come up as one unit. Oh my goodness. Keep it up, guys. One more exercise. One more. And up. Three, two. Oh, I had to go to the end. Okay. Oh, yay. Okay, so in this next one, now you can stick with the rollback we did in the warm up, or you can roll back, come up, tiptoe. Roll back, come up, tiptoe. Oh my God. You guys, I love this one. <laughs> Remember, you can just reach through. Just make sure you're not rolling on the neck or the head. You can put a weight in front. That might help you counterbalance yourself. And up. Nice job, guys. 20 seconds. Whew. Oh, this is so good. <laughs> it's so fun. Cardio core, hips, quads. We're getting a lot here. Four, three, two, and let's not forget coordination. Okay, next up, we're gonna stay on the ground, half burpee, side plank dip, plank position, jump in, jump back, side dip. I'm gonna stagger my feet the whole time. It's more fluid. If this is too much, Tap in, tap in. That's cool, okay? You can totally just stick with that. If you still want to get obliques, tap in, tap in, bring it out, bring it out, okay? So you're getting obliques with spiders instead of the side plank dips, if you want. Whew. Strong shoulders. Make sure you're not sinking into the side plank. 10 seconds. So I have a few more moves, guys, and I believe they're abs. Yes, as we rejoice. Okay, so abs are next. Support your lower back. Twist, reverse crunches. So you're gonna bring it up towards the face and then twist. So think about pointing your knees to the side. We're getting the obliques. If you have lower back issues, I recommend just sticking with reverse crunches and just pop it up, okay? Take out the twist if you need to. Chin is tucked in. We're not putting any unneeded strain. You can also bring your head down to the ground. That's cool. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> We're like two moves after this. Oh, we have a fun one. <laughs> Keep going. Twist and twist. Finish it out. Twist and twist. All right, so I'm actually going to switch these next two. We're going to go with Superman first because I want to end up with a bang. So Superman, super important to work lower back. <laughs> I like to have my hands into a field goal. Lift, bring it down. Notice how? My neck is neutral, up and up. Squeeze and back down. Oh, it's kind of slow there. Ooh, that's nice. <laughs> if yours doesn't smell good, I feel bad for you, son. <laughs> oh, let's go. Oh. Guys, there's no like medieval leaf blowing lawn guy today, and I'm kind of upset. <laughs> <laughs> up and back down. Up. We got one more back of this, and you better believe it's gonna be good. <laughs> All right, last move. Hollow man rocks. They do rock. 
Most challenging version, arms by the ears, hollow it out, you're rolling. Try not to touch the ground. If that's too much, you can hold it here, here, or support your lower back or drive your knees in. Let's go. So a bunch of different options for you. Listen to your body. If you're rocking, remember to keep your arms by your ears. It's really easy after a while to not have them there. Keep going, guys. Up. Woo. In this warm weather, my legs get more puffy, I noticed. <laughs> so if you ever are like, why are my legs so puffy? Ah, uh, the warm weather, man. It's us. <laughs> Keep going. Oh, God. Oh, well, this is awesome. <laughs> this is cool. Done. 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 We are stretching. You guys did amazing. Oh, that was so fun. I really had fun on that one. Right, let's do it again. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Let's bring both knees in and massage our lower backs. Whew. Make nice circles with those knees and then bring it back around. So if you haven't done my newest workouts, the inner and outer thigh and abs workout, or if you haven't seen them on my Instagram, go ahead and drop your left leg, keep your right knee in your chest. If it's getting warm near you, or even if it's getting cold, the weather's changing, let your body adapt. Sometimes it just takes some time. If you're like, I'm dying and I should be. Um, sometimes it just takes your body some time to get used to the new weather. Go ahead, bring that knee to the outside and breathe. Our gym doesn't have any air conditioning, so it's like 87 degrees in, in like a garage. <laughs> so you kind of got to be like, all right, I just got to get used to this. And go ahead, cross it over. I always think during those times, I'm like, you know what? It makes me tougher. <laughs> it just makes me more of a warrior. <laughs> breathe. You should feel some of the glutes. It should be really, really nice after like those static lunge drops and those rows. And let's go ahead and switch left knee in that chest this time and pull. Thank you guys so much for joining me, especially on like a Friday. I know you might have other stuff to do, but I appreciate you being here so, so much. Go ahead, bring that knee to the outside, opening up the hip, breathe here. If you have any questions for me, feel free to leave them in the chat before we go. I'll be happy to answer them, as long as they're appropriate. <laughs> no feet pictures. I will not give you feet pictures. Go ahead. Cross it over the body, left arm to the left, look over the left shoulder, breathe. Ooh. These stretching times, take it as not even just, just relaxing, but also like, where does my body need more attention? You can see where it's really tight and you're like, you know, maybe I'll stay here for an extra breath. Or maybe after this, I'll stretch it a little bit more. Go ahead, bring it back. And let's roll over onto the tummy. Hands by the chest, press up, and then walk the hands forward. Have a slight bend in the elbows. We're getting the core and upper of the lower back too. This is a real nice spine stretch. And bring it back, press back. We're gonna get the shoulders. We did work them quite a bit today. Knees into the hips, hands under the shoulders, keep the knees where they are, walk the hips forward, yes, our butts in the air, <laughs> and bring it to the fingertips. You can pulse it out, you can move side to side. Breathe. Go ahead, bring it back. We're gonna actually stay in this position where our knees are under the hips. We're gonna get our triceps, and this is really nice to use for like if you have a bench too, but we're gonna use the floor. Elbows to the ground, hands into class prayer. I like to bring them back and pull back. So really think about pushing your hips back. And go ahead, shift it forward. You should really have felt that in your triceps. Like that is, it's a pretty intense one. All right, let's go ahead. Uh, Crisscross applesauce. I like to add this um, next stretch in because I know a lot of you guys desk jobs or you're just super stressed during this time. So relax your neck entirely. Shakey, shakey. Let's take that right hand, bring it to the left side of the neck, left hand on the shoulder and pull. Breathe here. And if you want 
a deeper stretch, feel free to move that left arm out and then find where it's super tight and then just stay there and breathe. And once you're ready, slowly bring it back to center. A few side to sides. Oh my goodness. And let's go to the other side. Stay there and breathe. And then just remember during this time, take this time to really just thank your body for what it just took you through. I know it's hard sometimes we beat ourselves up or so, so critical of ourselves, but thinking about these moments we pushed ourselves. Go ahead, bring that arm out if you want to. We really just tried our hardest. Our body brought us through that, and that is so cool. So thank you, body. Thank you, thank you. And slowly bring it back to center, side to side, real nice and gentle, because we already got the brutal stuff out of the way. And go ahead, do, um, what is this, shoulder circles. I can't think of the word. I'm like anatomy, anatomy. Uh, I should have, I should have taken kinesiology. <laughs> I did in a different way though, not through college. And go ahead, crisscross, applesauce so your arms now. Shaky, shaky. And let's go ahead, knees together. Bring it back, tabletop. Curl the toes underneath. Push the hips back. Straighten out the legs. Get the hamstrings here. Uh, relax the neck, feel free to add some bicycles, some side to sides, whatever feels good for you. And let's slowly roll it up one vertebrae at a time. Let your neck be the last thing to come up. Oh my goodness, roll up the shoulders. We have the most important stretch of them all. <laughs> all right guys, let's go ahead and clasp the hands in front, pull the shoulders in, big inhale up, and exhale, push back, push back, push back. We are done for today! Yay! Thank you guys so much. That was so fun. I like waddled. I feel like I just waddled to the to the camera. <laughs> Hi guys. Oh, I'm going to read all of your stuff now. Tyler, I hope you can make it later. That's great. Yay, Anthony and Michelle. I hope you love the workout. Meet me. Same thing. <laughs> oh my goodness. Should I do this at a different time? Does this time work for you guys? Because I can totally. Do it another time if you need to. Ellie, pay, yay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Young Teasy, don't worry. Just do it later on. Thank you guys again so much for joining me. Uh, if you do want to support my channel, like, there is the super chat option, and then there is also in the description a uh, link that says support my channel, and you could totally do that. Uh, thank you guys again so much. Let me know if this time works for you. If you need it earlier or something like that, that's cool too. Clementine Diva, yay! Thank you, I'm so glad you liked it. So good, I think that's it then. I don't know, No one's, is everyone good? Is they, did you all die? It's hot. <laughs> all right guys, I will see you soon. Have an amazing rest of your day. Do all the things, thank your body for all it just took us through. You guys are awesome. All right, I will see you soon. Roar!